Good morning, everyone. Um, welcome back to my channel. So right now I am. Well, I woke up early. I woke up like really early. Um, and then I made my like tea and like digestive plus, you know, because today is the first day on doing the detox. Um, to be honest, I haven't gone grocery shopping for like my meals to be eating clean but um but that's okay because I do have a lot of stuff that will be I will be able to have that's clean and yeah I just need to I just need to get rid of the sickness you guys because I am currently I was so much better and then I had hot cheetos last night because I knew I was going to be on this detox and then now I'm just starting to like cough, cough again so yeah that's how it's going i just need to clean my body clean my digestive digestion like i just i just need to clean i need to clean our body but anyways so um so yeah so i'm drinking my tea right now i just i had made it and then i have it in my room and then i wanted to just rest a little bit more um and yeah so if you want to see how i do my day in this quarantine life this is going this is going on the third week you guys the third week but it is what it is so anyways keep on watching All right, and then I'm gonna go ahead and mix my um, mind health. So this is perfect for you if you have a lot of like brain fog and you need to focus a lot more. This is like the perfect healthy Adderall. Oh, birds, what's up birds? You awake? I have the birds inside because it's raining outside, you guys. It wasn't gonna rain today, but I decided to rain. Which I'm not against rain, but lately I don't want it around because the virus needs to go away. So I like to mix in my pomegranate and fizz. There you go. So this is a great source of energy, um, especially if you need a little pick-me-up without the crash. Um, I love the fizz sticks. If you guys know about this or heard of or you follow me on Instagram or anywhere and I talk about this, you know this is the shit. Everybody loves it. This is one thing that, I mean, there's so many things that I love, but if I had to choose something that I definitely cannot, absolutely cannot live without, it would be the Fizz. Because it gives me so, such a good energy, you guys, that it feels amazing. It feels like a, like a healthy high. Ahorita tengo el, um, el tos, pero estoy, how do I say getting better? Estoy mejorando, something like that. I'm getting better, so um, so that's good. I only have the cough like really little. I look so horrible, especially with this lighting, you guys. <sighs> we don't have the best lighting in the kitchen. Peace. See you guys in the next clip. All right, so I went ahead and showered, you guys, and then I'm just gonna go ahead and get ready. So I'm gonna look snatched in the next clip. Hey, welcome back. Okay, so, oh my god. Okay, so, um, I just finished getting ready and I'm debating if I should, actually I should probably have my shake. So I'm gonna have breakfast. I mean, not breakfast, I'm gonna have my lunch shake now. Alright, alright. Okay. Cozy vibes. Oh my god, I'm starting to get a headache, you guys. That is not good. Okay, I mean it's pretty much the same thing, I'm making it again, um, I'm glad it's not raining right now, it was pouring like all morning, so the dogs were like inside for like the whole day, 
So. Okay. What's up? Just kidding. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put my other... Everything that I put in here is pretty much the same. It's um, two uh, protein, two scoops of protein powder, one vanilla and one chocolate because that's the one that I like the most. And then a scoop of fiber. And then I also put in, I sometimes put in this, this stuff right here. I'll show you guys. It's a dandy blend and you put about, I think it's a tablespoon or teaspoon. I think actually it's a teaspoon of of this into like your shakes or whatever so much and I use this every single day obviously a teaspoon is gonna last a long time with this bag I bought this bag on Amazon I want to say it was like 30 bucks at least around there but this saves a lifetime like this is literally it's been here for like a good six months easy and then um it's 100% caffeine free. Uh, it has no acidity and has no bitterness and instant. It's herbal beverage with dandelion um, and this gives it a coffee taste. So for those, because on, when you're on your 30 days of detox, you cannot have coffee. But for those that crave it, this literally dissolves fast, smells like freaking coffee. It smells so freaking good, you guys. And this gives you that like crave of coffee because it tastes like it so i i like to put it in my shakes because it gives it a mocha taste it's super super bomb definitely recommend for those that um are willing to you know um get rid of coffee try to like not have coffee as much but yeah super bomb mix my skin elixir this one right here that does not want to focus and then my fizz and flavor rosé champagne okay uh, let me put some aguita in here but dang the sun is shining you guys it is shining out right now yeah let me turn on the or let me open the these things right here Ugh, we need oh my god we need some sun it's been like cold um and it's just been so weird this weather it's supposed to be starting to be nice like the following um following days it should be during the week it should be nice but who knows because the weather be having its own mind we can never trust but okay, so I'm gonna continue making my stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and just mix my stuff and pour it up, pour it up. Hope everyone's having a great day so far, or night, or morning, or whatever time it is for you guys that's watching. I hope, I hope all of this stuff that we're going through goes away. Let's just sit down for a bit. Is I literally just have you on the kitchen table and whatever. Okay, so I have such a headache right now, but I just ate something so that I should feel better. But, oh man. Okay, so I'm just gonna like chit chat with you guys, but this whole pandemic thing has ruined things. I'm so upset. Well, I'm not really so upset, but I'm pretty upset. So my sister was supposed to have her baby shower in April, April 18th. And that is not happening because, um, well, you know, it's like people are you know this is just not safe for everyone to get together and it's just better that everyone stays in their own like lane and you know we don't want to like contaminate even though we whether we're contagious or not we just don't want that environment and it's stressful you know like it's such a stressful thing to have to plan and to like do all that and, and what if people don't come and you know it's just like we're technically you're not even supposed to have the whole like 10 people or more so it's honestly just like 
at this point my sister doesn't want to do it so and it's obviously it's like to keep everyone safe and it just sucks because this is her first baby so it's like what the f you know this is supposed to be like her first of everything and she doesn't get a baby shower so it's just so heartbreaking and it sucks but i mean it is what it is um yeah so but yeah so that has happened and you know this whole thing has like ruined things because um i haven't even been working and i'm just like this is my third week not working you guys and i just i mean i've always i've always been such a homebody but it just definitely hits you a little bit more harder when you know like you really can't be out there and you just can't have the choice of wanting to go like literally starbucks was a, a distraction for me like just driving to like somewhere to eat was a distraction and they say you can still do all that but you just have to go to the drive-thru but i honestly would definitely not recommend doing that just stay home stay home you guys i feel like this is the best time to just really really stay safe be healthy and just follow the rules like i mean i get it it gets so boring i totally get it um i've I guess I've always been the type to not really let that affect me. I've always loved to be home. And even when I don't have anything to do, I just love not having anything to do. Is that weird? I don't know. Like, I really don't care, I guess. Um, I mean, I don't want to put shame to those that, like, are are really miserable right now. Um, you know, I just, I, I really love having the choice to be home also and i i mean you know there's so many things to do like there's been so many home workouts now that i'm like okay i could do that and then reading books i've been learning a lot more how to bake and like just creating a lot of things and and making food and and i know like right now i just feel like the only time you guys should be going out is to get groceries um or getting medicine or just something that you really really have to but like fast food starbucks like i honestly don't even think they should be open but i mean it is what it is i guess i i mean i don't i can't speak for others because i don't know their living situation um but i just feel like it's spreading so fast because we're still not being super careful so i don't know i mean that's just my thoughts and that's what i'm going through i guess um it's just it's been cool not gonna lie i've been i literally like i'll do videos for you guys i feel like i've been more active on that i on this account and my other account i do have a beauty um channel which i made like five years ago and i've been on it you know doing more beauty stuff lately too so if you want to go ahead and follow me on that one i'll link it down below but i mean that's like you know i've been doing stuff like that more often i've been vlogging i've been making things for you guys so it's like i i have been entertaining myself but watching movies i've been doing too and then i just noticed like time flies by and i've been honestly i've been sleeping in like way late like i'll be sleeping until like 10 30 and that's really late for me because i'm usually up by like 5 15 in the morning when i work so this is like this is something but yeah so honestly th those are just like my thoughts um and i just i really hope everyone's staying safe they're being healthy don't forget to have your vitamins drink a lot of water with lemons please drink a lot of water with lemons i am so fortunate to feel better i don't know if i shared it with you guys in this channel but i was sick i i got the cough and i got it really bad but i didn't feel sick at all like i felt still super good i just had this really bad cough and i wasn't worried or anything but there's always like that like oh my god you know there's a possibility but i never want to get myself to think that way because i feel like law of attraction you know so if you think about it and you just start to believe it it starts to happen and that's just me um and yeah so i've been reading a lot like i said i've been just not really meditating but i've been really taking the time to just zone out you know what i mean and just release all bad energy and stuff so all right guys well i'm gonna go ahead and just end the video here i'm sorry it wasn't like super productive um, i wanted to just get this video up for you guys so i want to just stop um <clears throat> and just go ahead and edit this video today so it can be up for you guys um but yeah don't forget to subscribe to my channel comment down below if you want to see anything in specific 
if you want to see anything specific holler at your girl um and turn on your post notifications if you want to be notified the next time i do post a video and that's it i hope you guys stay healthy safe and cozy in your home all right peace out you guys see you in my next video bye yeah, yeah you got that yummy yum the yum